Owning a website is no longer complicated, you just follow my steps carefully you will end up having one with all basic tools. In this tutorial you will learn how to host a website with a domain name and secure it for free. This tutorial consists of three parts. In the first part I will host a website, in the second part I will give it a domain name, in the third I will secure it by transforming its URL from HTTP to HTTPS. I'm Fishbach. Let's go with part 1. Type tripazerawebhost.com in address bar and hit enter. All required links are in video description. Click on get started. Click on free sign up. Click on Login with Google. Enter your email. Click on Next. Enter the password. Click on Next. Click on Let's Create Some Magic. Select Other. Enter the name of your site, consider site name as username for file manager login. Enter the password. Click on Submit. Select Upload your site. Keep the first tab open, don't close it. Now I am in the file manager, public HTML and TMPR folders or directories. You'll choose public HTML. Click public HTML to open it. Make sure that all site files are in one folder. Open it. Go back to Tripazero and upload all files and folders as they are on your computer. Let's do it. Create all folders as they are on your computer. Click New Folder. Enter the folder name. Click on Create. Do the same until all folders are created. After creating all folders, open each created folder and upload all files in it from the computer folder similar to it. Let me do it. I will start by uploading files inside folders and then files outside folders. Open the first folder. Click Upload Files. Click on Select Files. Locate and open a folder similar to the one you are inside on Trepo0. Select all files in it. Click on Open. Click on Upload. Open second folder on the left. Click on Upload Files. Locate a folder similar to it on your computer. Open it. Select all files in it. Click on Open. Click on Upload. Keep doing the same until all folder files are done. Done. Now I am going to upload files outside folders. Click public HTML to open because that's where files outside folders should be uploaded. Click on Upload Files, select Files, Locate Files. 
I only have one file, mark this, the file named index or home should always be uploaded in public HTML directory. Select file. Click on open. Click on upload. Go back to the first tab. Click on your site link. Wow! My site has been successfully uploaded. You're seeing that Tripazero added something on the site name and this is making it long and a little bit hard to memorize. How to give it a name of your choice without tripawebhostapp.com Mark that the name of your choice is known as domain name. Also keep in mind that the site is secured, I will come back on it later. Go to the file manager tab. Click logout. Close tab. Let's go with part 2. Keep the second tab open and open a new tab. Type freedom in address bar and hit enter. Open the first link. Enter your site name. You must choose extension which has get it now. Click on get it now on your preferred extension. Oops, not available. How to fix this? Type your site name with a preferred extension and click on check availability. Click on Checkout. Choose a period. Click on Continue. Enter your email address. Click on Verify My Email Address. Open a new tab and go to your email to verify. Click on the verification link. Enter your details. On address, enter your location like street address or your place name. If you don't know the zip code, you go to Google and search for it. For example, if you are in Mumbai, type in Google search, what is the zip code of Mumbai? On password. You will enter the password and re-enter it again on Confirm Password. Check on Terms and Conditions. Click on Complete Order. Let me close these tabs because I no longer need them. Click here to go to your client area. Oops! Again? But don't worry we're going to fix it. If you made this error as me, you follow how I am going to fix it. If you didn't meet the error, you just wait for me until I log in. Close this tab and open a new tab. Type this link in address bar and hit enter. Enter your email address. Enter the password. Click on Login.
Wow, logged in. Now, click services. My domains. Go back to the first tab. Click on manage website. Click tools. Click set web address. Click on add domain. Select park domain. Click on next. Copy name server 1. Go back to Freenum. Click manage domain. Click management tools. Click manage name servers. Select use custom name servers. Paste the copied name server 1. Go back to the first tab. Copy name server 2. Go back to Freenum. Paste the copied name server 2. Click on change name servers. Go to the first tab. Enter the site name you created. Click on park domain. You see that the domain is parked. Go to the second tab. Enter your site name and address bar and hit enter. Wow! You see? Now you can enter your preferred site name in any browser to reach your website. See here, I still have one problem, this site is not secured, remember that before it was secured, how to secure it again? That takes us to part 3, let's go! Keep this tab open, go back to triple zero tab. Log out. Close the tab. Open a new tab. Type cloudflare.com in address bar and hit enter. Click on sign up. Enter your email address. Enter the strong password. It must have a minimum of 8 characters with a special character and a digit. Refer to this example on your screen to set a strong password. Click on create account. Click at site. Enter the created site name. Click on at site. Select free plan. Click on continue. Wait for DNS record scan.
click on continue. Click to copy. Go back to Freenum tab management tools name servers. Replace the name server with the one you copied from Cloudflare. Go back to Cloudflare and copy the second one. Go to Freenum. Replace the second name server with the copied. Click on Change Name Servers. Go to Cloudflare tab. Click here on Done. Click on Get Started. Make sure it's on. Click on Save. Click to turn on. Click on save. Me personally don't need this. Click summary. Click on finish. Click on check name servers. Wait for one or two minutes and refresh the page. Great news! Cloudflare is now protecting your site. If you're not seeing this message on your computer, keep waiting and refresh until you get it. Go back to your site tab. You're seeing that is not secured. Refresh the page. Bingo! Connection is secure. You're seeing that the SSL certificate is issued by Cloudflare. If your site is not yet secured, you wait and keep refreshing the page until it's secured. Go back to Freenum tab. Click Logout. Close the tab. Go to Cloudflare. Don't forget to check your email for the Cloudflare account verification. Click Logout. Close this tab. That was it in this tutorial and I hope that you succeeded. If you had a problem, let me know below in comments. Thank you very much indeed for your time. In the next video I will show you how to renew a free nom domain. Let me stop here. Bye! Thank you.